Hey guys, hope you are good. Before we get started, it's really important to understand how a grid works. A grid is basically a division of a whole. Uh, in music, usually a grid will be dividing a uh, quarter note or a beat into four equal uh, divisions. So to be uh, to to show you this, I'll be using. I'm still on learningmusic.ableton.com website, and I'll be using. Um, in the chapters section, I'll be going into notes, keys and scales. And here's a grid. So we have all of the notes here from C to C. And basically, I'll be clearing this. A grid is like I was saying a division of a whole. Here we've got 16 divisions of a whole, which would be uh, a whole note or four quarter notes or four beats. So here, by default, when you're learning music.ableton.com, you've got a little square that is basically a 16th note. And you can stretch these notes. As you can see, I've got that little black line. And if I click and drag, I can just drag the note and make it as long as I want till the end of that, that grid, which is four beats. So here I've got 16 note that was uh, stretched to a, a whole note then I can go back to a half note or a quarter note an eighth note dotted eight note and then going back to 16 note so I'll be making a little melody out of C D E N G just them being quarter notes I've got here D E and then G beautiful melody Within this website, obviously, uh, we want to complexify and make something maybe a little more interesting. So let's break up uh, these quarter notes and make them into patterns that are a bit more complex. I'll start with, I like using uh, the root note. So here we're in C. I like using the root note as my first note to start a melody or a bass line or a chord progression usually. So I've got a dotted eighth note on C. I'll add the 16th note on D. Then let's go up to F. Make it an eighth note. And then G. Eighth note as well. Oops. On we're on the second beat. Third beat. I'll be going down to F and E. 16th notes. D as an eighth note. And then I've got an E, a D, an E, a D as 16 notes. So let's listen to this melody. Mm -hmm. 